Hey guys, it's Gnosis the God with a review on Star Wars The Force Unleashed 2. Uh, so, uh, I'm going to start off right off the bat with uh, what I think is good and what I think is bad about this game. So, uh, I think that this game was a was, there was a lot of good in this game, actually. Uh, graphics wise, gameplay wise, and story wise, this game was great. Um, a lot of it actually got a lot of negative reviews from other game uh, reviewers, but I think it's good. Uh, I'm a pretty big fan of Star Wars, and I think that this game does a great job making you feel, making the players feel uh, really unleashed. Uh, that's gameplay wise, of course. It's uh, it really gives you uh, a large variety of super, of uh, powers of the Force that aren't you don't see in the movies and in other Star Wars games, which is I think is great. Um, it brings a new kind of feeling to the players, and I think that's one of the things that makes this game great. Uh, now, as you see, uh, as you can see, this game. <coughs> Uh, it really, it's uh, really good at making you feel unleashed, as I've said before. Uh, it pretty much makes you <laughs> feel like a boss. So, um, what I mean by that is that you're using like uh, these new powers, as I said before, like uh, force repulse, and um, you're using two, two lightsabers instead of one, which is pretty cool. And you actually carry them in a a uh, pretty awesome way as well. You carry them kind of, I guess you could uh, kind of like backwards, uh, but it looks awesome. Now, as you can see from this scene, it, you feel it's, you feel like you're in the game, I guess, but you feel, yeah, you feel like super, super strong. Uh, and I like that a ton about this game, as you just decapitated all those stormtroopers. So uh, you do, you kill a lot of stormtroopers, um, and uh, it's it's fun. I mean, you you get to see these different ways, uh, harness these different uh, ways of the Force that you've never seen in the movies or in other video games, which is why a game is called Force Unleashed, I guess. But um, so uh, graphics-wise, this game was great. Also, I mean, especially this the gameplay and uh, the gameplay graphics are great. Uh, not as good as like Battlefield Three and. Uh, some of the newer games out. This game isn't too new, but uh, it's it's actually pretty it's it's pretty new. But uh, the graphics on it aren't amazing, but they're good. They're good enough so that you en you'll enjoy the game, uh, which is great. It's just enough, and so uh, I'd give the graphics a good uh, a good review here. But uh, I'm gonna say that in the cinematics, the graphics are a lot better than uh, in the gameplay, which is expected from from games. Uh, but uh, if uh, the cinematic or if the gameplay was as good as the cinematics, this game would be awesome. Uh, so that's the. St I also uh, another factor that I liked of this game was the uh, storyline of it. I think the story was great. Um, so pretty much you're playing, in The Force Unleashed 2, you're playing as a clone of Starkiller, who is in The Force Unleashed 1. Uh, and Starkiller, the, you're a clone, and Darth Vader has cloned you because Starkiller was his apprentice who later died, uh, who died in the first Force Unleashed. Uh, however, uh, he did train Starkiller, and Starkiller was super, super, super powerful, and uh, uh, gave the Force Unleashed its name. Uh, but Darth Vader is planning to uh, clone all of these uh, versions of his apprentice, or all of his apprentice on a Kamino, which is where he also clones the where the uh, clones are uh, cloned <laughs> and uh, the stormtroopers are cloned. And uh, so I think that's uh, another thing I like about this game is that it adds a lot of new maps uh, that you don't see in the first uh, Force Unleashed, uh, which is which is pretty cool. Uh, I liked Kamino a lot. Um, I like how you're just 
like breaking through everything to get out of there and uh, finding a way out and uh, that's cool so uh, yeah the story was good the one thing I didn't like about the story actually was that it seemed super super short I mean uh, it seemed so short I'm not sure if that's actually because it's actually short or if it's just because I'm having such a good time in the game that uh, it feels short uh, and that's a good thing, I mean, uh, that you're having a good time, but I think that this game should be longer, uh, especially, it's, there is an online factor to it, but it's not, like, uh, first-person shooter, uh, good, so, the only thing you're really gonna be doing is playing single-player, and, uh, in order f for the game to be good, you have to have a story that's long enough uh, that's going to keep people uh, playing it. And the story is good and it's long, er, and it's, but it's short. Um, so that's the thing that I, that's one of the major things that I didn't like about it. Uh, besides that, there isn't too much that I didn't like. I mean, um, so yeah, again, guys, you're just you're feeling this. Uh, power that you uh, don't see a lot. I mean, you see light of uh, Sith lightning in the movies, but not like this. I mean, you're wreaking like disintegrating people in this game. Um, so I believe I played both the fir both the first and second Force Unleashed uh, games, and I think that the second was definitely better. Uh, they made you feel unleashed. They the uh, first game was. I mean, it was a good starter. It uh, it uh, brought a lot of people in. I mean, it looked it was pretty cool. But then with the second one, it doesn't look that good because because uh, of how good this one is. Um, so I believe game wise, this game is awesome. Uh, other people haven't liked it, but I think it's great. I think you guys should get it. Uh, it's it's fun. Uh, the graphics are are uh, good enough for that you can enjoy the game and uh, the story is good except for the fact that it be that it's short so uh, I recommend that you get this game I'm gonna give it a final of uh, three stars out of five because the graphics weren't amazing uh, I give it three because the gameplay was good, uh, the graphics were okay, and the story was good. And I, uh, it's not four or five because of the uh, short length of the story, and of because after you get done with the story, there's nothing you can do besides repeat it again and again. Uh, but you do. You get a lot. Of, you get a lot of customization in this game. You can customize different lightsabers. I have a black and a white one, uh, which looks pretty cool. Uh, so there's some customization. You can look change what your guy looks like a little bit, but not much. Uh, so yeah, guys. Uh, pl pl if you like this uh, video, uh, please like, hit the like button, subscribe, tell your friends about it, and check out some more of my videos and reviews uh, on my channel. So, thanks for watching. Uh, three stars in this game. I recommend that you get it. Uh, recommend you play the first one. I'll probably have a review on that one later. Alright guys, so thanks.